Hey, how's it going? Today we're going to go over how to draw a clown skull, okay? There's a few different versions of that on the site, so go check out the other ones on the page. Um, but let's get started, okay? First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go and I'm going to draw a circle right here for the actual kind of red clown nose that some clowns have. Well, actually a lot of clowns have. Okay, that's going to be the red nose. What I'm going to do is I'm going to draw the eye sockets behind that. So I'm going to draw a line up, line up over here. More or less going to pull across, pull across over here. Curve down, pull in for one eye socket. I'm going to kind of line it up over here if I can and find the other one. I'm going to go over here cheekbone over here cheekbone line up line up okay now I'm gonna go to find the side of the temple side of the temple curve across curve down Gonna pull in, gonna pull in. Pulling down over here on this side to find the skull area, down over here to find the skull. Whew. Don't forget, by the way, if you like learning how to draw Halloween, absolutely hit the subscribe and click the bell notification right now. When you click that bell notification, it's gonna let you know when I post. I only, I'm gonna start only posting around Halloween, um, and I might post on Christmas, but um, that's kind of it. And, uh, what happens is when you subscribe, you're going to subscribe for the next year as well. So take two seconds to subscribe so you can find this channel again in the future when you need it. I'm going to go over here. Teeth right there. I'm going to go over here. Line. Line, 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 line. Gonna go over here. And I'm gonna fill in the eye socket. Um, pretty much flat, honestly. I'm just gonna fill it in flat. Marker's kinda dying a little bit. Uh, I might change it out a little bit here. Cause I need to fill this in. While filling this in, uh, I wanted to say, hey, what's up? How's it going? How's your day? Hopefully you're doing good. Uh, type to me in the chat um, what you're going to dress up like for Halloween. Uh, or or if you're not going to dress up for Halloween, like what TV show are you looking forward to for Halloween? I would say for me, I'm looking forward to watching probably... Um, there's an old show called Tales from the Crypt. I want to watch that show. I haven't really seen much of it. So I want to go and watch like those I think they have them on I might just buy them on like DVD or something because sometimes they have them for streaming I know somewhere but I I don't know when I buy the DVD I can have like extras and commentary sometimes so I, I might just buy them on DVD or something cool cool filled in and now I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna put some hair on the side over here they, they tend to have like zigzag right there pull back gonna go over here on this side curve up in up in and over here <laughs> right on now we're gonna give this a little bit of color okay so I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna grab a red for the nose and you don't have to do this by the way but I mean I'm just gonna do it for the video I think it's a pretty cool idea to kind of color it you can use anything crayon colored pencil marker markers of any kind I'm using a Copec marker these things tend to be a little bit more expensive so be aware red for the nose I'm gonna say for the hair I'm gonna do green like a light well, let me see like a light green if I can find my light green you know, a green like this this is a Prismacolor marker and I'm just gonna see I like that kind of green right it's kind of like slime green I like that 
Feels like the Joker. Feels like uh, you know something of that nature. Right on. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab a gray, a gray to kind of uh, shade the skull a little bit, not too much, nothing too wild. Um, oops, it is the ah. Line underneath here, down, over here. Curve over here on this side, fun for the brow area. Um, I'm gonna throw a little flat line over here as well. And what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna grab my black marker again and I'm gonna throw like little scraps and stuff around the actual skull. So maybe like a line here, little details like these thin lines around the side. Sometimes right here like little scratches because you kind of want it to look like an aged out skull. By the way, don't forget if you want to learn how to draw anything, and I mean anything, go to the main website. Uh, we also have some merch there. It is um, sketchingeasy.com. Go check that out, sketchingeasy.com. Sketchingeasy.com. Go check that out. If you want to be, go to the beginner lesson, you got to click on the dragon, and there is uh, the beginner lesson on there. Line, line, over here, line, 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 line over here in this area, curve, 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 curve. Again, just kind of like throwing these little tiny scratches that start to add up. That's kind of the important part of it. They start to add up. They're, they're not much like on their own, but you're just throwing just vague little scratches all over the place. Maybe even sometimes a little dot over here. It looks like there's crumbs of something or dirt or soot or something. And uh, yeah. Whew, that's pretty much it. I want to thank you very much for sticking around here. You are amazing. And I want you to say hi to me in the comments section. Uh, much love to everybody watching this. Um, Halloween is my favorite season. I really, really want to do a good job this year, and I really want to spread the channel, like really grow the channel this year. Um, thank you so much. I will see you in the next video. Hit me up. I'm always available to you know talk or you know answer questions about art, of course, obviously. Um, that is it. Thank you so much. And uh, don't forget, at the very end, you're going to see a screen, uh, like the screen clicks. If you like this video, click one of those screenshots, okay? One of those things. All right, later.